Hey, this is Nafka. Hey, um, I kind of wanted to touch basis with a little bit of a uh, discovery I've made. Um, I'm kind of in my mobile uh, workstation here. <laughs> As you can see, um, I'm just kind of sitting here in the uh, living room and uh, working on some models that I have here from uh, Hawk War Games that uh, I'm putting together. Um, and as you can see here, I'm putting together um, some of the new um, Scourge releases. And I've discovered some really amazing things about these models. And I thought it was worthwhile to uh, take a look at um, and show you some of the improvements that nobody's talking about. Uh, let me show you. Uh, the first thing I want to talk about is the bases. All right. Now, flying bases, um, generally speaking, are pretty fragile. Now, Hawk War Games has always done a good job with their bait with these bases, and I like these. All right. The neat thing is, is if you look here on these models, and I'm in bad lighting right now, but you can see uh, right there, uh, you can see that that little piece. Um, that little nub right there fits on top of these glass bases. Now for those of you that are familiar with uh, these models from uh, any of the aircraft from Hawk War Games, you'll understand that that just slides right on top and they come right off the base. Really nice concept. Now what I didn't realize is I had put one of these things in, um, glued it in, and I couldn't figure out why the base was wobbling. It was driving me absolutely crazy. And what I realized, and I'm hoping that you can actually see it here, is that they've reinforced their bases, um, not on the bottom, but on the top there. If you look, it's reinforced and comes up just slightly off the edge. Um, that is really cool, and that's going to give a lot more stability to these models. Uh, the next thing I wanted to show you is... I'm putting together one of these new flyers. Um, this this really cool flyer right here, this is a medium dropship uh, for the Scourge, comes with a little mini, uh, mini art caster that you can put on them if you want to upgrade. Now if you look at the slot that this goes into, okay, it looks pretty solid there. And look at the bottom of this piece. Okay, now when I put this in, and I'm going to be doing this with one hand, uh, it when you push it in and give it a little push, it doesn't come out. And what that basically means is this piece doesn't need to be glued. That is just nice, and that is a nice addition if you don't want to pay the extra 15 points. Uh, for that art caster on it you don't have to and you don't have to decide to do it when you put the model together you just paint them up separately slide them in there when you want them um, anyhow that's pretty much what I wanted to show you uh, there might be more discoveries of course as I'm putting together uh, my scourge and some more UCM models but I thought that, that was definitely worth sharing anyhow uh, this is NAFCA Fate 212 and I'll be talking to you later.